if you have trouble sleeping at night or just need a little help to unwind before you go to sleep, here's a nice little yoga routine you can do to ease you right into La La Land. So all you need is your bed and a couple pillows. I will grab one of my firmer pillows to start. If you have a firmer one, go for it. Soft one is fine too. And we're gonna start with, can you tell I have a lot of pillows? Um, I love pillows. So we're gonna start with whatever pillow you've got in a supported child's pose. So just take a moment to set yourself up, get comfortable, bring the pillow in between your knees as you widen your knees and let your hips sit back towards your heels and then just lay yourself down over the pillow and just point your head in one direction or the other. And just take a moment to feel the weight of your body begin to melt down into the pillow. Feel your shoulders relax, the back of your neck relax, feel your chest relax. And just notice the length of your spine gently stretching in this child's pose. And perhaps you start to notice your breathing. So as we wind down the day, and get ready for bed. Allow your thoughts to wind down as we keep our focus now to the breath, gently breathing in, gently breathing out. And just start to notice the rhythm of your breath. Each exhale, letting your body melt a little more. Letting your mind melt a little more. Maybe you even feel the tension release around your jaw. Maybe even a softening of your temples, your forehead, your eyes. Slow, steady breath. And then gently lift your head and just turn to the other side if that feels okay for your neck. So we get a nice little neck stretch on both sides. Again, you're relaxing your shoulders, relaxing your jaw. Just feeling the weight of your body completely supported by the pillow, by your bed. Notice how it feels to have your breath slowly and steadily move through you. thoughts begin to creep up into your mind, again with each exhale let them go, there's nothing more you need to do in this moment, just breathe. On your next available inhale, slowly rise up. Maybe rock a little bit side to side if that feels good for you. Feel free to stretch your arms forward as you pull your hips back, getting a nice little stretch here. And then you're going to bring that pillow right behind you. And I'm gonna give you a little side view so you can see it better here. You're gonna bring that pillow right behind you and maybe grab a second pillow if you have one. And you're gonna bring it to the top end of that pillow. So from here, having a small of your back totally supported by the pillow, gently lay yourself back and you can use that second pillow to support your head. And if you don't have that second pillow, don't worry, you just get a little bit of a deeper heart opening. If that's a little too much for your back, feel free to bend your knees and let them rest against each other. 
or you can stretch your legs straight, let the feet flop to the side, feeling your hips relax and your legs. And if you feel for a hip opener, you can bring the soles of your feet touching each other and let the knees open up and out. If that feels uncomfortable in your hips, you can just grab another pillow or two and roll them under your knees. Otherwise, just let your body be. The less you fidget, the more that you can allow your body and your mind to relax. Allowing sleep to slowly come on. Once again, feeling your facial muscles, your jaw relax. Shoulders soft and relaxed. Let your back completely release and melt into the pillow. And feel your slow, steady breath wash over you completely. As if you're washing off the day. Just letting everything be. Each breath full and deep. Just allowing yourself to breathe into whatever areas might have picked up some tension today. Sometimes when we are stressed, or actually all the time when we are stressed, we tend to carry areas of tension in our body. For me personally, I tend to feel that tension in my hips when I'm stressed. Maybe you feel it there. Maybe it's in your shoulders or your neck. Wherever you might be carrying it, continue to deeply breathe each exhale, letting it go. Perhaps as you breathe in, you can mentally think to yourself, let. And as you breathe out, you can mentally think, go. Let. Go. Let go. And whenever you feel ready, very gently, you're going to move out of it. If your knees are open, use your hands and guide them back. No use for your muscles now. You're totally relaxed. And just roll to your side and rise up. And we're going to end this with a wonderfully restorative legs up the wall pose. And we can use legs up the headboard or wall or whatever you have behind you. So you're going to move all pillows out of the way for now. You have a lot of pillows like me. And just keep one pillow for your head. You're gonna scoot right up to the edge of your bed where your wall is or where your headboard is. And just lie on your side. You're gonna scoot your sit bones right up against that wall or that headboard. And you can support your head with the pillow. And just make sure, real quick, make sure, when you roll onto your back, which we're about to do, make sure you have enough room behind you. Okay, just to avoid anything. And we're gonna roll right up. You can even scoot your sit bones as close as you want to the wall and adjust the pillow behind your head. And just bringing both legs up above you, let them rest against the wall or the headboard. You can bring your arms in any position that feels comfortable for you either by your sides, or you can connect one hand to your heart, one hand to your belly, maybe both hands on your belly. Just tune in and see what feels best for you now. As you connect back with this slow, steady breath. And what Legs Up the Wall does is really help to improve your circulation. It allows the heart to rest 
and calms the mind and the nervous system. So feel the sense of calm wash over you as you continue the slow, steady breath. Perhaps drinking in the sweetness of the silence around you or the silence within you. Let your breath blanket you. It's warm and comfortable as the day melts away. You feel your body release and relax even more. might feel a little tingly. That's normal and lights up the wall. If it feels a little weird, you can wiggle your toes a little bit. Or maybe gently hug your knees into your chest. And if you wish, you can stay here a few more breaths. And whenever you're ready, just gently slide your feet down Bring your knees into your chest and just hang out for a moment. You can wrap your arms around your knees. Give yourself a big hug because you made it through today. And just take a moment to give thanks for doing something good for yourself today in your mini practice of yoga, your bedtime yoga. When you're ready, roll to your side and just hang out for a moment. Don't rise up too quickly. In fact, you're not going to rise up at all. You can go right to sleep. So whatever movements you need to make to get yourself comfortable in your sleeping position, you can just slow and gently, maybe even keeping your eyes closed. Make yourself comfortable as you lie down completely. And allow sleep and sweet dreams to meet you. So once you got into your sleeping position, Let's take a deep, deep, full breath in, your biggest breath of the day. Take it all in, in, in. And exhale, side out through the mouth. <sighs> Let it go. Let it be. Let your body be. Let your breath be. And enjoy sweet dreams. <laughs>